Ultimate Yoshi here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Croc. And in this episode, we have a crab to join our crocodile adventure. I'm scared! You should be. Because it's freedom time! <laughs> freedom and sand! You look like a snail lizard right now. That's a backpack, I'm guessing. Yep. Okay. I think that's all I need to know about this game. Okay, I regret- That's too much you need to know about this game, basically. I, I regret everything. This- what? <laughs> is this video game? <laughs> it is- it is gam. It, it, it doesn't look like bad video game, but is this video game? All that was for just for a gobble, apparently. Uh, uh, okay! I'll take your word for it! <laughs> you don't get any explanation, Crab. I didn't. I don't know, but these levels are confusing me more than Mario 64 or weird levels. Like, I'll, or, you, no, more so than Mario Sunshine, uh, extra stage, challenge whatever they're called. Is that green death, or is it life? I don't know, I've never seen it before. Oh, is that a spyro gem? What is this? It's a disco ball, I oh. think. I don't know, I call them disco balls. Um, they don't they, have a name. I feel They're like, like they, Sonic rings. I'm pretty sure they should probably uh, look into getting a better disco ball that has very little faces. It's sparkly though, and that's all that matters. No, it needs more polygonals. It needs as many bad polygons as they have in real life. I thought th I thought you were gonna say bad pun instead of bad polygon. I was. And I was oh. gonna reply with, they already have bad puns in this game. Yeah. Yeah, oh. Oh. No! Oh no. Oh hey, and um... Yeah, now we have a blink mission. <laughs> don't, don't remind me of him. <laughs> oh. I already was reminded of blink. <laughs> in this game. I don't oh, want to no. be more reminded. Oh no. Is this jelly gonna give me a bonus? Let's find out. What? I don't know, I randomly found a bonus by jumping on jelly last episode. I'm scared. This is what I am doing with my life, Crab. Do you not respect this? <laughs> I don't want to. I'm getting nothing. <laughs> Balloon! Um. <laughs> so you you told me you skipped the last boss just because you didn't like it. It was underwater. This sounds like an extremely professional let's play going on here. Professional? What? Yes, totally, definitely. That's what this is. And I should know about Wink, professionalism. Like, nudge, nudge. I just I just tested live streaming, and I was the only person there. I ended up. Having to dig out of a cave with my fists for like 10 minutes because I was stupid. No, what? Professionalism. No, um. Uh, but no, yeah, I, the I'm disco the most balls. I'm professional getting through doors. I, I, I still. I still have the headcanon that disco balls are just real life low polygon spheres. Like, whoever developed them into reality just did a horrible job modeling them. Disco balls. God is just a professional 3D modeler. 4D modeler. Okay, okay, screw that. Into the door. <laughs> See, that's my so philosophy on this game. I try something, if it fails, I ignore it. Oh my gosh. Also, yeah. they are there are scorpions in the in the gook. A goo gook. Well, at least it's not sand. I am sand. The, the, How are you? Well, Hi, Sand. I'm me. All this was just for a key. How am I? Ow. Scorpion. Oh. Ow. These little gunk holes. It's like, is was, is this the remains of an ancient city? Um, these are where what's left of the sewer manholes, and on the sides is where the buildings used to be. That's what I think all this is. I think you're thinking way too much into this. No, this is entirely Croc canon. is not post-apocalyptic. No, Croc is entire. Croc has deep meanings, Alti. You must accept this. This is the only reason why this game makes complete sense. Well, I can't argue with that. But still, you're looking way too into it. No, I'm not. You are. 
See? Buttons. Signs of technology. You missed the underwater electric gates, though. Signs of technology! Also, that stuff under you, the weird mud gunk. Is it that, is mud. It, it's kind of terrifying. It, it looks like mushrooms. Looks like psychedelic mushrooms. Or, or one of an, or like an earthbound background. Oh gosh, yeah, a lot like that. But, but it's terrifying thinking under that, due to the way the current is, there've got to be thousands of little holes or something, having each spouting up gunk. Maybe, maybe there's metal grates under there from the sewers of the world that used to be. Which of doors? Which of these doors did I come into? I thought you went through the one to your left when you gave up. What's going in here? I'll find out. Also, getting stuck on doors. Constantly. Okay, this is where I want to be, I think. Okay. Emphasis on I think. But aren't you going to ignore it because it was giving you a hard time? Yeah. What? What? Okay. You threw a snowball at me. You threw a snowball at you. Oops. Oh no, not Sonic Logics. All right, let's go to three five. Oh my gosh, you really leap of faith. <laughs> you you <laughs> you really don't care. Is this like Mario 64 where you don't have to, or...? It gave me levels more than I wanted when I asked for a code, so I'm just accepting it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> opportunity, so, Crab. It's opportunity. <laughs> so, in other words, this is just a demonstration, not a let's play. <laughs> it's No, this is the most professional let's play. 100% walkthrough, right here. Giving you, see, you ride the balloon down, you get all the little disco balls, and you jump up the are, things, are and these, you do the stuff, and get all the gobbos. Are these speedrun strats putting in codes? <laughs> speedrun strats put in a code, get to the end, get to the last level. Sounds legit to me. This is the one code at a time speedrun, so you actually have to beat a few things before the rules allow you to use another code. Also, judging by the background of this stage, I'm also guessing the post- uh, this is the post-apocalypse of the Earth- Hey look, Earth it's Stonehenge. Oh, yeah. See? See? This is the post-apocalypse of the Earth exploding. That's why everything's floating, because there is no core, so it's all just stuck in space. What you're seeing below you is not actually mountains. It's just the void of space while there's a ring of gases. Oh my. That's all I have to say. I think Croc is affecting you more than it is me. No, I'm entirely fine. Are, are you sure about that? No, not really. I'm never sure of that. Oh, there's my chair. You that, this, th moment. this is cruel because you want to break all those boxes but press the button well now you can oh except I don't care yeah who cares see I stopped caring about this game in episode one further point is it's the post apocalypse so of course croc would not care whatsoever about the things around him because all he needs to do is his tasks. That, that platform didn't extend down very far. They never do. Like, it just, it just kind of stopped. These sort of games admittedly have... They, they lose atmosphere every two seconds. Because they don't care the fact that everything's just floating. That implies that they had atmosphere. Well, I mean... They, they do, see? Post-apocalypse, it's a great atmosphere. That's... that's not... There's a better word I'm trying to think of for atmosphere. Uh, Setting? You know, no, I mean like, the, the term when you're actually really engrossed into a game... Immersion? Uh, immersion, thank you! My brain decided to be worse than you today. I wouldn't be so sure about that. Also, there are more signs of the greats that are under the mud. That the... 
that are causing the weird swirly effect. So, Bob, get... Wait, was that level... That level actually was called Leap of Faith. I didn't notice. Oh my gosh, why? Why? Leap of faith. Why would you... Oh my gosh, I've been playing Spyro Season of Ice because I've only had Season of Flame. I'm not gonna lie, Season of Flame is so much better of a game. You should let's play it. I'm actually thinking of let's playing both of them. I'm gonna play Season of Ice first. Not only to actually, you know, be a feeling a bit completionist with playing both of them, but also just to show how many things Season of Flame improved. Like, geez. So many G's. 4G? 3G? 3G? G Force? Uh, no, not G Force. Is Spyro a Star Fox pilot? G Force? What about the NVIDIA G Force? Mm hmm, graphics cards. Mm hmm. Oh, what? 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 Oh, I didn't even know those devils were laughing earlier. What else would the devil do but laugh? You know what they remind me of? That sound effect reminds me of the, uh, kamikaze penguins in Spyro 3. What? The ones with the TNT that they push around, they laugh and then charge at you with it. What? The little devils, they were laughing. What? I... I don't know what you're talking about. You don't remember the ice level in Spyro 3? How did that kill me? Oops. Also, there were two ice levels in Spyro 3. One of them I blocked from my mind, except for the music, and the other one I don't remember. <laughs> um, the one with the cannons where you shoot the ice. That's the one I blocked from my mind. Don't what? make me remember it. Wait, you didn't like that stage? What? I forget what. Why didn't you like that stage? That was Frozen Altars, Crab. Do you know what Frozen Altars had? I can't remember. You must have blocked it from your mind, too. I just remember all of my fond memories of the stage, not your bad ones. I mean, what? Do you know what Frozen Altars had? No. no. Frozen Altars had Ice? Yeti Boxing. Wait, the Yeti Boxing was there? I thought that was at the later level. That is the later level. Wait. The one I'm thinking of is in the second world, right? I thought there was two ice levels. There is. There's Icy Peak and Frozen Altars. One second. Wait. Uh, I, 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 <laughs> is Icy Peak the one with the cannon? Yeah, Icy Peak is the one. I remember a can. The, Icy Peak is the one with. Oh, the I'm thinking of how there were turrets in Frozen Altars that you froze enemies with. Icy Peak had the cannon, Frozen Altars had the turrets, oh, okay. and the penguins that you had to freeze and stand on. I completely forgot about that, yeah. Um, no, yeah, Icy Peak is the one I'm talking about. Also, I don't want to do this level. Oh, okay. You didn't want to do Frozen Altars. Yeah, but that game I was 100% in. This one I don't really care about. <laughs> Are you really? Oh my gosh! <laughs> well, that's one way to solve. You really don't care at this point, do you? Ooh. Well, what? Apparently there's a little cutscene if you say no. The Flappy Bird? <laughs> Flappy Bird, what are you doing here? Get out of this... We don't need this game even worse. <laughs> no, this is actually a good game. Oh, well. I just don't care about it. Alright, let's see. <laughs> it's a good game! As he doesn't actually play any of it. Oh Let's my see. gosh. Last password. Left, 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 down, right, right, left, left. Down, I don't... right, down, left, up, right. I... There's a thing missing. Oh, I didn't input all the... I didn't put in all the L's. Oops. Um... Left, left. Down, right, right. Left, left. Down, right. Down, left. Up, right. I'm not sure if you're keeping any of this in, but... I am. But... I can't help but notice, but at least on the page that I'm seeing through Skype, most of it just likes. Okay. I've beaten 
two levels in this episode. Now let's slice the beach! Oh my god, bro! Oh my god! <laughs> yes, Croc, life is a beach. <laughs> oh my gosh, though, really? Oh, this doesn't look like a beach to me! I've been lied to! <laughs> Though, I mean, judging by what it's implying and judging by the curious platforming, maybe it really is a beach. <laughs> but there's still no beach balls, which is... Well, no! They're Ma disco balls. I, maybe they're, they're not disco balls. balls. Maybe they're just really terrible beach balls. <laughs> or very stylistic ones as a product gimmick. There's a hole in the floor there. Uh, that looks almost more like, well, it uh, looks more like Z-fighting. No, this is not Dragon Ball Z, I mean, the, the thing that happens when two planes start overlapping and hate each other. Did you get stuck? Oh wait, no, they came back. Might be dead anyway. Nope. We live. This oh. game... It, admittedly, this game looks like it actually controls half decently. I just died from climbing up. Congratulations. Because he posted Congratulations! Up. No, what? But no, yeah, this game actually looks like it handles pretty decently. The camera is pretty awesome, for the most part. Um, I haven't seen it really do anything too crazy. I think I know what I need to do. And, um, yeah, all these little tiny platforms, and you seem Aha! to be getting over I knew it. Fine. That enemy became existing. I didn't know this was Spyro 5. I like how these boxes look. They're very party. Ah yeah! I don't know. Party box. Either way, I got a key. Is this a croc party? I got the thing as I died. Effective. Also, I'm just sitting here silently trying to figure out how to make Mario Party jokes with croc. Don't mind me. So is this like... Something between Mario 64... Banjo Kazooie and Zelda. It's like, like, think of it like Mario 3D Land. I've never actually played 3D Land. Then think of it like a lesser Mario 3D World. I was assuming that. <laughs> um, yeah. But I know, like you got keys and stuff, and you have to go to the doors and unlock them. It's just kind of funny. I don't know, I never put it together that's kind of like Zelda. Maybe it is, it's, it's just very linear. Oh gosh, well, not this again. In a lot of cases, see, fairies! No, what? Oh, jeez. Please, no. Well, no matter what we say, Crab, it's gonna happen. You're gonna Ow. happen. Why is a, a Nutter Butter or, like, it's like... A peanut butter candy bar, just stretching. Also, I'm trying don't question it, Crab. It's Croc. Uh, no, I'm go. I'm going to question it. You can't stop that. What? I got a key. Let me through. It's not the right key. Fine. <laughs> that lock got really angry for a split second. You died. I wanted to be at least one level, but I don't care. <laughs> oh. You know what you need? A mohawk. I think I just made a mistake. I think I'm going to need to input the code again. Uh, Alright, I'll do that in between episodes. Next time, let's play Crop Legend of the Gabos. We're going to... Have a brief preview of more other levels without actually beating them, apparently. 
Doo. That's how much I care about any of this. Hey, the bird doo. -doo.